Good morning. Woo! I am currently on a, another hike. Um, if you guys are new to my channel and you haven't been following my journey or watching any of my videos, huh, I have, let me grab it here, developed a passion for hiking. But uh, I haven't been doing much hiking lately because of the close call that I had in Arizona. But I'm better prepared now than I was in Arizona. I do have my dry fit t-shirt on under this hoodie. It's about 50 degrees windy. And uh, I have my camel back full of water. I have additional two to three bottles in my bag. Got my walking stick. Got my protection from man and animals. There's not many animals on this trail, but they said like turtles or billy goats, squirrels. But I am back at it again. I can't stay away from hiking too long and I'm still exploring Nevada. And my God, if you live in Nevada, your state is phenomenally beautiful. Look how beautiful Nevada is. There are other people on the trail, but uh, I mean, look out there, it's beautiful. This is your state. And if you live in Nevada, like, look how big, blue skies, it's sunny out. It's been a minute since I've hiked, so let's roll. I like her stick, man. I got my stick. Maybe I should open it. Yeah, I should. That's good enough for now. Good morning. Good morning. How are you? Okay. You're probably gonna be able to hike real damn fast, real fast. But to me, I'm just like, uh. Now take your time, girl. I know how it is. Arizona nearly took me out. Oh, did Yes. Oh. So, girl, I get it. Be safe, okay? All right. You have a wonderful day. You too. Oh, let me get my life together. What? Look at that, guys. We gotta hike all the way down there. This is crazy. It is. What's what's the bad part is this sand. Yeah. Makes the rocks feel like like you're walking on grease. Let's see here. Oh, there's stairs. Okay. Whoa. There's stairs. All the way down. Can you, can you let me know when you get like, Yep. Like I'll let you know, sir. One false step, I'm done for. Let's see here. Um, yeah, it's fine. It's uh got a little sand right here, and then it's just a step down with your stick. Uh there are sticks that you can, or rocks you can step on. You just got to take it real slow. Okay. It's not a big drop, but it is a bit rough. I'm not going to lie. All right, thank you. Yeah. Thank you. Good luck to you, sir. Would you want me to stay around, or are you good? No, no, we're good. We'll probably get back. Yeah, fam. This ain't no joke. I mean, it's no joke. I'm glad I brought my walking stick. I mean, we gotta. Yeah, those people, they didn't, that couple in front of me, they're a little bit nervous and scared to try to take the walk down here. I get it though. I'm glad I wore my new t shirt. I mean, look at all that. Man, that's crazy. Oh.
I think what makes this hike difficult is that, oh man, it's full of sand, you know? Uh, it is sandy and uh, the sand makes the rocks really, really slippery. So you have to take your time. And uh, you know me, fam, I walk really fast. So you just can't be in a hurry. Um, and you have to have a stick. I know I have two, but I only brought one. And I've been doing one for a while, but oh, wow. Oh, they're going back. Yeah, if you look, fam, they are going back. They're not even gonna brave it, and I get it. And let me show you guys where I just came from. If you see, I just came from in there all the way down. It is really rough, but once you do it, you get to see this beautiful, beautiful view. I mean, you only see this through hiking or through others who do hike. And uh, it is definitely dangerous for sure. Like I said, you've got other hikers on the trail, but let me put you guys away and I'll be right back. I am so glad I wore my dry fit t-shirt under this hoodie because this hoodie's about to come off. And what I like about Nevada and this area over um, Arizona is there's actually shade in a lot of the parts. But uh, look at this. Look how beautiful. You got hikers coming down behind me. But man... It's okay to hike alone, do your research, be prepared. Uh, I see a lot of solo hikers. I showed you the guy I walked by. Um, you just gotta be prepared. We got a ton of water. Um, and uh, I actually feel kind of cool. That t-shirt is, that wind is hitting me and I can feel that cool air blowing up under my t-shirt. Let me grab the map and see where I'm at, fam. I had to download it too. Okay, we are still um, on the right track. On the right track. All right, let's go. Look at, what is that? Like a, like a little stream if, it's, if it rains. Wow. This is absolutely stunning. This is stunning. Look at that. What does that sign say? <sighs> Look at the footprints of the people that have trekked over here. Warning, you are not on trail. You missed your turn. Like, that's pretty cool. Look at these beautiful rocks. Formations. It's peace. Ah, it's so peaceful out here, man. So peaceful. Okay. Thought I heard something. I'm not trying to be funny. I heard something like a scream. And we're like in a, a wash or a flood area. We're at the bottom. You see, kind of down below everything and then everything above us. I thought I heard a scream. That's crazy. All right, let's keep going. Actually, I want to go to the top. I don't like, especially when I'm hiking in new areas, I don't like being in the uh, bottom. I like to be up top so I can see if anything is coming. Uh, uh, there we go. Ooh, looks better up here anyways.
hopefully we see billy goats. Oh man, we gotta go between this tree. Let's look around for any snakes. I don't see anything. Any snakes on the ground? Uh, nope. All right, let's go. Oh, there we go. There we go. We gotta go through there, fam. Let me check the map and make sure. Um, yes we do. Let's roll. Yes we do. Okay, we're going through. Man. Okay. That's, oh. Okay. Oh, this is crazy. Wow, we gotta go through this. Man, first of all, appreciate beauty. This is just absolutely stunning. Um, I just came from over there. Oh, it smells like somebody was smoking a little bit of the the the, the plant. It smells like a straight plant out here. And I don't see any types of farms. Huh. Oh, we gotta go through this crack family. Remember my other my uh was it my last hike or the hike before last? We had to go through a massive crack. Look at this. This is why you hike. You can't be afraid to get out here and see the beautiful things. You just have to press forward, fam. I got a foghorn. I got bear spray. I got a sharp, big knife. You can't be afraid. You just gotta go through. I have you guys with me. I'm telling you, Arizona took me out, fam. It took me a while to recover from literally, look at that beautiful little cave. From literally almost having to go to the hospital. I could have lost my life. Bit narrow in here, but not too bad. Not like the other hike. So hopefully we see some billy goats. Uh, I feel bad for the other couple. They really wanted to come out here, but they couldn't make it. They couldn't make it. The hike goes continues that way but I like to take a little sneak peek at what's over there I kind of want to fam or maybe try to climb up there uh do I trip do I do it girl you by yourself you by yourself girl let's check the map make sure we're still on track yeah we're still on track I keep forgetting Ooh, that plant is strong or maybe these plants smell like that. I, let's go take a quick peek over here. We're not going to go too far off trail. I'm not stupid. Um, I am stupid. Prospect 11 miles total. 5.5 miles to main road. Yeah, we won't go too far, but look how beautiful. <laughs> You can see where people have put little rocks in the holes. Let's, let's just go a little ways in here and we'll get back on trail. Wow, this is stunning. Man, I mean, you can just kind of climb your way up there. Look at the ridges, it's beautiful. Looks like a face. Looks like a face. We'll go a little ways and then we'll get back on trail. I got a map. I'm good. 
I always download a map, guys. If you've never hiked, I'm not an expert hiker. This is probably my eighth hike. Make sure you don't depend on your phone. Your phone can lose service at any time and you're screwed. Make sure you always download the map. Wow. All right, and it just keeps going. Uh, oh, it's some water back here. Got really wet. Oh wow, it's rough back here. It's really rough. We're gonna go ahead and turn around, but uh, take a look at this. It's pretty rough. It's, it's got a lot of rocks, a lot of vegetation, hills and stuff you gotta climb. It's so peaceful out here. You can hear a pin drop, it's so quiet. Look at the beautiful colors, different forms and shapes of these rocks, and that just stunning. Absolutely stunning. All right, let's get back on trail, fam. Let's get back on trail. We are back on trail. Let me check the map, just to be sure, because I, for a minute, I was like kind of Losing my sense of direction for like a split second. That's why you never go off trail, fam. Don't do what I do, ever in your life. Okay, we're back on trail. It's just stunning view after stunning view after stunning view. I came from over there, back all the way back there. This is one of those hikes where the beauty is like along the way. You're not like hiking to like a beautiful lake or a scenic drop off cliff. Look at the red rocks. I wanna sit down for a minute and take it all in. Cause this is just absolutely stunning. I no longer want to rush through my hikes. You watch my hikes. I do walk fast. That's just military days, fam. But now I learned to just take it easy. And just enjoy the ride. <sighs> Man. Um, another hikers and their dogs. And their dog. A single dog. I wonder what kind of plant that is. I don't see anything on it. And these things here, just surviving and thriving without water. I wish I would. Look at these purple rocks. I'm, this is the first time I've seen purple, or lavender. I don't know, lavender color? Look at that, it's like purple. Lavender, and it goes all the way there's even a bigger rock up here that is just straight purple, like fire purple. That is so cool. I've never seen purple before. It's that big rock right there. First time for everything. Oh, we haven't seen any billy goats yet. I'm sad. I want to see the little goats walking along the side of them. The big rocks. Look at that. It's purple. And that's stunning. And then it just trickles down. It's purple. Straight stunning. I came from all the way up, all the way back there. I've been hiking for, for a minute. Kind of lost track of time, but that's what I want. I'm not on all time schedule or anything like that. Oh, we're gonna, we're gonna go inside of that rock right there. You see that hole? We're going in there. Heck yeah.
guys if you're new to the channel and if you don't know it by now on this channel you're gonna get everything hiking adventure tra international travel in-state travel via van train plane whatever man i'm a nomad i'm not i'm not tied down to one mean or source of travel and i'm not tied down to one specific spot or area i can't stay sit for t i can't stay still for too long and i love to explore have some of my stuff been a bit dangerous yes yes and I, a lot of you in my comments, wait for somebody. You should have somebody go with you. If I waited on somebody to come with me to go hiking to some of these hikes that I've done that have been pretty rough for me as a first time hiker, or these places that I've explored, places I went, I would never go and get it done. You'd be waiting forever. I still have a ways to go, fam. But I think I'm going to go ahead and catch you guys after the hike. This is so beautiful and I want to explore more. So I'll see you guys after the hike. Man, this is incredible. Man, that was a hike. And this shirt that I bought, this is a uh, dry fit shirt. It, when I say I, it's, it's wet, but I feel so cool. Whew, this was nice. This was nice. So I was thinking about dinner. And I have been dreaming about Sonic's new double cheese peanut butter burger. It's a double cheeseburger with peanut butter. Caramelized onions and bacon. And I'm like... Hmm, that actually sounds really good. I'm allergic to peanuts, but I do have cashew butter. I have onions, I have bacon, I have beef. I think I'm gonna make my own version of Sonic's double cheeseburger with peanut butter, caramelized onions, and bacon. I think we're gonna do that today. I'm gonna think about it on the on the drive out of here and try to find me a place to hunker down um first i gotta go get a shower shower first and then we're gonna i'm gonna go hunker down god answered my prayers look at those billy goats what we're driving out of the trailhead and i see some billy goats what that is so cool billy goats i have never seen them are these billy goats fam it's a whole family of them we're not gonna i'm not gonna hit you a whole family of billy goats. That's so cool. What? <laughs> Shower complete. I have to go to Walmart because I have one bun left and the bun is expired and I'm not about to eat expired bread. So let's go to Walmart and get uh, hopefully like one or two buns from the bakery. I'm not trying to get like a whole thing of them. And uh, let's go find a place to sleep for the night.
like this. These are thin slices of cheese. That's why it looks like that. We're gonna add the caramelized. This is real bacon bits and I caramelized that and cooked that in that um, jam. We're just gonna pile that bad boy up. This is a really fattening dinner. Cashew butter is extremely high in calories, but who cares? We're using it today. And then, there we go. Here are the finished results. Look at that my version of Sonic's viral peanut butter sandwich. First bite goes to you. Now my turn. Ooh. I mean, look at that bite. That is wild. Mm. 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 Mm -mm. This is not for the faint of hearts. I mean, look at that bite. Fresh bread, juicy patties. Caramelized bacon with that strawberry jam, that sweet and salty and savory. Look at that. Look at that cashew butter dripping off the sides. The patties are cooked to perfection, not overcooked. Look at that bite. Mm. Mm. You don't really taste the, the cashew butter. I mean, you kind of do, but the cashew butter gives it more of a, <clears throat> a creamy kind of texture, a creamy consistency. It is wonderful. And that bacon, caramelized bacon that I, I used uh, strawberry jam in. Oh, man. You should try this, guys. Mm. And the star of the show is the bread, man. It just brings everything together. This is the kind of burger you can only eat like once a month. <clears throat> Will I make it again? Yes, but no time soon. And yes, I'm drinking water. That is sweet, savory. It's so good. Salty. Mm. Mm. Oh, I'm getting full. Today was good. Um, I've been missing going on hikes. Arizona put the fear in me when I when I um, stopped sweating. And if you haven't watched that video, go watch it. It's a hike I did in Arizona. It was a very beautiful, challenging hike. But man, I was not prepared. And um, after that hike, I hadn't hiked since. You know, so this is my first hike in what a couple months, but maybe even three months. I got that fire in me. I might I might try to do one more hike before I uh, head out of here and um, go overseas. I'm, I, you know, there's a couple more hikes that I, I did see. I was doing some research, and I'm like, wow, that looks challenging, and that looks like a lot of fun. Um, I'm really glad that I got those dry fit t-shirts. Uh, it was cold this morning. 
I know it may have looked hot because that sun was beaming down, but it was a nice breeze and I was sweating, but I didn't take off my hoodie because the, the t-shirt was cooling me off. I felt really cool. It felt, I felt comfortable. So I just kept it on, but what a treat to see those billy goats right as I was leaving. I was like, man, I didn't get to see any billy goats and bam, billy goats. I have net. It's the first time I've seen billy goats like in person even though I wasn't out of my van, but still, I have never seen them. I've only seen them on TV. It was so, so cool to see that. But I got a lot of cleaning up to do, and um, I'm going to chill for the rest of the night, get some reading done, relax, um, yeah, and finish trying to polish off this burger. I am full to the brim. Fam, you guys are amazing. Thank you so much for your continued support. It means the world to me. Thanks for hanging out with me, tagging along with me. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video, but I'm out. Thanks for watching. And as always, I will see you guys in my next video. Take care. Peace. I'm telling you guys, if you haven't tried this, mm, mm, mm. Mm, mm, mm. Bacon bits are just as good as the real bacon. This is real bacon bits. You don't have to stress about trying to cook bacon. Just get the real bacon bits and fry them crispy, greasy. Oh, so good. I'm going to polish this off and chill for the rest of the night. Mm.